everyone, how's it going? CJ here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the iFrox Cocoon case. So, let's do this. This case is for the iPod Touch 5th generation and 6th generation, and it is a two-part case. It comes with a rubber case and a hard outer shell. Here's the packaging for the case. I think it's really nice packaging. Uh, on the front, you've got the iFrox Cocoon branding. Uh, it tells you it's for the iPod Touch 5th gen, but it will also work with the 6th gen. Uh, you've got a picture of the iPod in the case, and there's a little open here. And if you open the flap, which is also magnetized, as you can see, which is very nice, uh, it says, easy, durable, protective case, edge protect screen on any flat surface, and durable exterior with pliable inner core. Uh, those are the features. And then you get a nice view of the case through the plastic there. And then on the back, uh, it tells you more of the features. It's got more Cocoon branding. Uh, shows you that it's a two-part case. Uh, the seal of quality and uh, what I read you that was on the inside of the flap. Come on, focus. There you go. And that's about it for the packaging. This case does have pretty much all of the cutouts. It has the camera cutout, um, and the cutout for the speaker, the lightning port, and the headphone jack. The one cutout that it's missing is the one for the little iPod Touch loop button. Uh, that's on the fifth generation, so if you use that feature a lot, uh, you may want to look somewhere else. Uh, but I don't use that very often, so it's not a big deal for me. And it also has uh, the up and down volume buttons and the lock buttons button, which is very, they're very tactile and clickable, and uh, not mushy like other cases. Installation is very simple. Uh, all you have to do is take apart the case into its two parts, then you put the iPod Touch inside the black rubber portion and uh, make sure that's all settled in and then you take the blue outer hard shell and snap that in um, around the volume buttons first and then you snap it in around all the corners and you are good to go. The rubber part of the case adds a very good shock protection and it also uh, adds good lay on table protection, so I'm not worried about my iPod being broken when it's in this case. Durability on this case is very good. I've been using it for over a year now and it's held up really well. My one complaint is that the blue sort of matte material on the back starts rubbing off after a while, but uh, other than that, durability has been great. So overall, I really do like this case, and I would recommend it to anyone who has an iPod Touch 5th uh, or 6th generation. So that about wraps up this video. I thank you very much for watching, and if you liked it, please leave a like, and uh, subscribe for more tech content from me. I hope to be putting out some more uh, videos pretty soon, and... Also, you can follow me on social media if you would like. I'll leave links in the description. And uh, I think that's about it. So thank you very much for watching. Peace.